about Joe Flacco. Uh, it's kind of an interesting dude. Obviously, right. spent a lot of time in Baltimore and then here with the new team this year. So it's kind of up and down. Yeah, I mean, he's a very established quarterback. At the same time, he's a strong on quarterback. Uh, I think they're playing well. I think one of the main keys for this game is going to be stopping their run game. They have two really good running backs, uh, Lindsey, or um, yeah, I think it's his name, uh, who pretty much likes to bounce outside. He really wants to, he runs very hard too. And then Royce Freeman, who's a bigger guy, who really wants to get downhill. But they also use those guys in the pass game as well. Uh, they have some really good receivers. They have a established receiver in uh, Emmanuel Sanders, and they have a younger guy in uh, Cortland Sutton, who's a big, bigger body guy. So, like I said, I think they're a great offense. It's going to be a good challenge for our defense to go out there and, and try to stop those guys. So, I think it's definitely going to start with the run game, and then, like you said, try to stop you know Joe Flacco from taking those big plays and big shots. I think we'll be pretty good. How do you continue to keep consistency? I think that's so hard for teams to do, individuals to do, but it seems like you've done that since you've gotten here. Uh, I, th I think consistency starts with just your daily routine. I think you try to be consistent with everything you do on the daily, and hopefully that will equal to consistency on the field. So, I mean, it's, it's, it's a lot of things that I can still work on. I'm not going to sit here and say that I'm perfect. Uh, I watch the film and I critique myself as hard as I do anybody else. So, uh, I never try to be that guy to come here and be like, hey, I'm the most consistent. Hey, follow me. Hey, the end day, I want guys to understand that, hey, I may be playing well, but at the same time, it's more work that needs to be done. There's more stuff that I can fix. So, And, and that's what everybody is going to be on. Every single play, you can always find something wrong with it. So I try to critique myself really hard. You mentioned Philip Lindsay. He's a guy you really got to take good angles on, right? The yeah. Speed, I mean, if he gets a step on you, it's going to be a hard time. Catching a guy like that. Yeah, I mean, once he gets to the edge, man, this guy's run so hard. He's like, he, I think he's trying to hit a home run every time he gets the ball in his hands. So I think he's a great running back. Went to the Pro Bowl last year. So, and I think he's having another good year as well. So he's kind of, in my opinion, he's kind of the heartbeat of, of that offense right now. I mean, when you see him running the ball, he gets up, he gets up pretty hype and stuff like that. So we're going to have to contain him for sure. Do you, uh, Kayla mentioned your consistency as a player. What about as a team? I mean, is it. A lot of fans are frustrated at the inconsistency of this team. Are you guys frustrated? Do you, do you guys still see, you know, positives, I guess, going forward? Yeah, it is frustrating. Uh, I think we know that we can play good football. I mean, we show it, but it's just inconsistent. So I think until we find a way to be consistent, uh, we're always going to come here on it. I mean, it's like it's crazy because, you know, when you win, you know, the locker room, you kind of feel good. But when you're not winning, you know, you're not feeling really well. So I think the main thing we had to do is not really ride the wave and try to be consistent every day with our routine, doing what we need to do. And uh, like I said, there's always going to be stuff we need to fix on film. But as long as we can understand that, hey, the work is never done, we keep working, keep working, I think we'll find a way to be consistent. How do you improve the red zone defense? Uh, it's something that was really, really high last year. Right, right, right. Wise for rankings, and you guys have kind of dropped this, this season. What, what's, what do you think the change is, and how can you improve that? Uh, I, I mean, I think, first of all, we got to start letting them get down there. Uh, we start letting them get down there. And uh, I think teams are doing a really good job scheming us up. You know, I think when you're in one of the top red zone defenses last year, you know, a lot of teams are watching that, trying to figure out ways to beat us. So we, we just had to be more consistent with our with our eyes, um, just different things like that. And I think, uh, yeah, I, I think we'll get better as the year going.